if you trust Mark. A couple weeks ago on the channel, I posted this screenshot. This was the headline that was posted by a local media source in response to an officer involved shooting that occurred on June the 22nd, 2021 in Columbus, Ohio. Today you'll get to see what really happened. On June 22nd, 2021, Columbus police officers were responding to multiple calls of shots fired. When they arrived on scene, they saw people with weapons still firing those weapons, and the officers returned fire. There's two 911 calls that I want to play for you regarding this incident. The first 911 call will be from the people who lived in the house that was being shot up at the time of this incident. The second 911 call is from someone who heard the gunshots, thought they saw the suspects, called 911, and then the officers arrived on scene during that call, and you'll get to hear that person's interpretation of what was happening at the time, and you can decide for yourself if officers were firing shots into a group of people that were having an altercation, or if something else was going on. So I'll let you listen to those calls, and then I'll be back to walk you through the first part of the shooting incident. 911, what's the address of your emergency? 21st Avenue. What's going on? I just had a whole bunch of kids come to my house and shot my house there. And you're at 21st Avenue, yes, yeah. Did you see who there. did it? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay, who was it? Um, Her name is... um. Um, Casey Ethica or something. I don't, my kids are on their way. They know their names. Okay, is she black, white, or Hispanic? Black. They were in a blue car. I don't know what kind of blue car. A, a blue SUV. I might see if my neighbors have cameras. Oh my God. Which way did she go? I don't know. We ran in the house. Okay. Your kids are on their way. Okay, thank you. What's your name? My name is Elizabeth. All right. So officers will be out to talk to you. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye bye. Nine one one. What's the address of your emergency? Um, it's uh twelve thirty five. There's like fifteen gunshots. Okay, you heard fifteen. There's shot at the house. Did you yeah. see anything or just hear it? No, I seen it. They're in a blue, uh, a blue. Uh, Chevy car. Blue Chevy sedan. Actually, I think the, actually, I think the cops just pulled up on them. Oh, they're shooting with them. They're shooting with the cops. They're shooting at the cops. Yeah, now they are. Oh my God, dude. Dude, yeah. Here, oh, they're a bunch coming now. Actually, so I'll let you go. They're pulled up now. Okay. All right. Now this part's gonna happen so fast that the first time I'm gonna show it to you, we're gonna play it at 20% speed. Some numbers that I'd like you to consider while you're watching this is that from the moment the officers turned onto the street to the moment the officer begins to open his door, they had four seconds. The moment the officer gets out of his cruiser and draws his weapon was three seconds later. And then the first shot is fired one second after that. When the officers arrived on scene, this is what they saw. So by my count, the officer who you're watching now is going to fire eight rounds in a six second period of time. That's eight rounds fired before he brings his gun back down to the low ready. The other thing that's worth pointing out is that the officer on the left hand side of the screen is running towards the suspect while the officer who was driving the vehicle is still firing on them. One part of this interaction that might surprise a lot of people is that this officer who you're watching on the body camera now just got done firing eight rounds at suspects 
his adrenaline is going to be very high, but I want you to pay attention to how he acts when he approaches this vehicle and the language he uses when he's talking to them. And you can tell me whether or not you think these are well-trained police officers. Lastly, I'm going to play this whole clip immediately after this in real time. I just want you to be advised there's not going to be any audio in the very first part because as you can see right here in this freeze frame, the officer is just now reaching down to activate his body worn camera. This incident happened so fast that he didn't have time to put his camera on before exiting the vehicle, but it's pretty miraculous that he had the peace of mind to reach down and turn it on, even though the suspects potentially could still be within eyesight of him and could still fire on him. Don't go anywhere. Stay here. We were just trying to leave. Jesus. They start shooting. They start shooting. Who's shooting? They start shooting. I, I can only hear one person. Which house? White house right there. Where that blood that truck is at. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. The White house right here. Okay. We just started shooting. Hey, I've got a uh, blue Chevy Cruze. John Ida Edward 5230 saying it's the White House, north side of 21st, about five houses down. Ten three, come on, send us more cars. Come south of 20th in Cleveland, male black, all black jumpsuit, black firearm. I think he just ran southbound. Donnelly's in the alley north of 20th, west of the alley, west of Cleveland. Uh, they're saying he ran this way by myself. Get chopper, please. North of 20th, west of Cleveland. Chopper, please. Chopper, please. Chopper, please. Find a pilot, please. Hey, where do you run? Where do you run? Male black, all black. You guys see him running this way? Shots are coming in 1274 21st, 1265 23rd, 1267 21st. Did you see anyone? There's a shooting suspect just ran down here. Anyone run down here? No. No one. I'm changing the oil. I want to see somebody. Help with the gear, but okay. Yeah, I'm good. 